Hello YouTube Pipe Pals. This is a VR to Pipes and Tobacco. He is having a 2,000 subscriber giveaway. And um, he asked a question. His question is, if you only had one tobacco manufacturer to choose from for the rest of your life, you can only choose that one, which one would it be? <clears throat> and that is a very, very tough question. It requires some reflection. And... Uh, First off, I am smoking this new Peterson, a um, little bit of a stack of Dublin. I've been enjoying this. This is my first new pipe in over five years. Um, I have lots of bends, and I uh, realized that I was missing some straights. I have a few straights, but most of them are... Uh, uh, codger pipes i guess um you know i have a yellow bowl and and uh dr graybo and most of them are are uh, pipes i found at a at a, a antique store or whatever and i restored but this has been smoking fantastically <laughs> i've been Pretty much, pretty much nonstop. I'll, you know, I'll pick a pipe and let this one rest for a while, but um, go back to this, get to know the new pipe. Anyway, oh, and in it, I have some uh, Aaron Moore, like, um, well aged Aaron Moore. It's uh, pretty much black. I mean, it's a dark flick to begin with, but um, it's had probably about six years of age on it. Very good. Um, Love Aaron Morflake. If you guys haven't tried it, I definitely suggest uh, picking some up. One to smoke now and one to sell her. You will not be disappointed. All right, on to the VR. Um, man, like I said, I mean, there's Peter Heinrichs, Peter Stokeby, Hearth and Home, Lane, McBaron, Peterson, Dunhill, Cornell and Dale Camoys. CAO, Briarworks, Gallus and Hogarth, GLPs. I mean, it goes on and on and on. And all of them have some really, really good blends. Um, I was thinking I was going to go with um, with uh, Peter Stokeby's because they have um, two of my very favorite, um, well, three of my very favorite, uh, Luxury Twist, Bullseye, and Navy Flake. Um both of them age very well and they don't need age they they smoke great right out of the tin right out of the bag and you can order them um they're fairly uh inexpensive and and um you can stock up and so i was gonna pick peter stokeby but the choices are somewhat limited even though all of them most of them are, are really good um but and then I was going to choose Peterson because I took over some of the Dunhill blends and um, has some really, really good, really, really good blends um, there. Uh, however, I'm going to fall on McBaron's. Uh, McBaron's also makes some <laughs> really, really good blends and some of my favorite. Dark Twist, Plum Cake, Roll Cake, um, ODF, I mean, those are my favorite. And then they have, um, a lot of other offerings, uh, and make, uh, tobaccos for other, other companies. And so I'm going to settle on McBaron's, um, just because of the variety and some of my favorite blends are McBaron's. So that's it. Uh, fair winds and following seas till we meet again. Thank you for the contest, pipes and tobacco. Uh, congratulations on your 2,000 subs. And uh, I encourage everyone to do um, enter the contest. Like I said, um, a nice pipe of four, I think it was four well aged tobaccos, um, uh, a variety of tobaccos. And um, if you do a VR, I believe it's three entries. If you do a comment, I believe it's one entry. Uh, if you are 
a subscriber and have never posted a video to the YouTube pipe community and you post one for the first time, you get five entries. So all of those who are kind of on the fence, don't know if they want to uh, become a content creator. Um, now's a good time. Um, post a little, little, little video. It doesn't take much, just a two minute, one minute little video uh, telling your favorite uh, tobacco manufacturer and it's quick, put it up there and who knows, you might get hooked on making videos. Um, really, it's just talking to a group of friends out there um, who are interested in the same hobby as you are. Um, and it, uh, it's fun. It is fun. Uh, that's it. <laughs> Fair winds, following seas. Till we meet again. Farewell.